so important for our little ones to remain creative and to find that expression that they they so desperately need to grow and evolve. And Ken Correct. is here um, with a solution that can really have your babies and your little toddlers in that creative space. And that's also important for them, but it's also important for the parent to keep sane and to actually <laughs> right. have a place for all this stuff So for to selfish go. reasons, yes. Ken's has this really wonderful DIY for you. <laughs> there you, go. There you go. I think the babies are a little young to start putting wood together. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Start them young. All DIYers this start out at dangerous. three years old. Yeah. It's a little dangerous. Well, it, this all came about because, so Coco's in kindergarten. She just started kindergarten and she's all about the homework. So she actually asked her teacher on day three, like, can I get homework? Here they are. Oh, so they're, oh, so yes. right now they pull the coffee table in the family room out of the way and sort of like get to town because they were doing it on the dining room table, but then come meal time, you're like, yeah, no. exactly. Yeah, so, you're so brave you got white sofas. I know. Slip cover, slip cover. Oh, slip covers. Okay. And just, can I just point out, can we bring that photo back up? My son, Heralding Fall, is wearing a football jersey and the beginning of ballet season, he's wearing a tutu. <laughs> Oh he wore that all day yesterday. He would not take either no. one. No. <laughs> okay, that's very creative. Uh, there house. you go. There you go. So uh, you start off with an old kitchen cupboard, and you can find these like Craigslist. Your neighbors probably have one in the garage. When they redid, no one wants to get rid of them, but then no one actually ever uses them for anything. Yeah. Um, if you buy one online, it's going to cost you about twenty bucks or so. Okay. Um, and all you want oh. is the front. You want the front and the drawer. So if they're busted up, just take that. Run. Your neighbors would never okay. even notice. Um, you're going to start off by just taking out the screw and taking off your front door panel. Okay. And if you want to give me a little glue just around that top edge. Okay. Right there. Wait, right here? Yeah. Um, and then all you're going to do is there are a couple of different options. You're actually right along the edge, right close to it. Oh, no. Did I go it's too okay. far? You know, it's all right. Everybody oh, has a last Debbie. Name. Debbie. Oh, no. Just stick Debbie. to hosting. Start some <laughs> okay. All right, Chesapeake That's Falls. That's good. Oh, <laughs> too soon. Too, too soon. soon. All right. So you're going to put that all the way around, and you're just going to secure that. Um, so no more drawer. That drawer there. No the drawer. more drawer. Yeah. You want to plug that hole. Now, for like, you have a one-year-old. Yeah, three and, a three and one. Yep. Debbie and for Alexandra, you don't yeah. need a lot. You just need like a little place for them yeah. to sort of feel. So for those, this is a real simple version. All you're gonna do is get a piece of plywood. This is just quarter inch, cut at the hardware store, pre-cut, mm -hmm. and all pre-cut to match your drawer. Exactly. Okay. The match this dimension. All the and then all you're gonna do is glue. You don't really even need to screw it on. No, Debbie, no glue. No, no glue. Yeah, stop it with the glue. Note to self, don't ask Debbie to glue. Um, <laughs> you didn't tell me specifically where. You're right, you're right. I didn't, I didn't. Um, and then all you're gonna, that's all you're gonna do, and then you're gonna add in legs I'm going to show you um, later so what you have is a place for them to work here they can like open it here oh, this becomes right. a little place um, and this all came from a yeah. yeah I candy handmade um, did these and I absolutely oh. loved them this is where I got my inspiration I think we have a photo and then they just decorated the top oh, so super cute. simple for really young kids that's great now right. yes. I love for that. those of us with older kids um, when the stuff starts to come along yeah. right. and they won't get rid of anything, all the artwork comes yeah. home. You're, you're almost there. Yeah, you're starting to yeah. be there. Yeah, Connor's up in there right now. Right. Yeah. So take that drawer. There are other, like the big kitchen drawer. Find one of those or any kind of box that's going to be slightly smaller than your cabinet. Um, if you can't find one, you can make one. Go to our Facebook page and I'll show you how I made this one. But you should be able to find one out there that's the right size. And then all you're going to do is put the box, put it on top of the box instead of just that single so that all of a sudden you have tons of storage and all you're going to do so you oh, said slightly are smaller are but this are you a nail gun oh, person yes i am i might have overspoken all you're going to do is oh. a little thing there right there and yep all the way down push it all the way down and oh how come i'm so nervous pull the pull the trigger oh not here oh my gosh that was down and pull fail. the trigger oh! Oh, what was I doing? Why wasn't I doing? Yeah, you were ah, so good. At yeah, you're real. Woo! Right, right, right. All right, here we go. I'm better. <laughs> okay, the, the scream is not oh actually no. I love it. It's actually. Did you see the wind so that kicked fun. back on her? Yeah, the kickback. Like now a, I'm doing this with you at home. A screwdriver, hammer, nails is really all you need. But or glass. Wow. Well, you glass. get that and you get the scream. So then, uh, <laughs> what you're going to get there is this great, and all of a sudden, a place to hold oh, the gosh. homework, hold the stuff. Yes. Big like, enough. Because that stuff that comes home, it's like. Seriously. And I think it's just the thing that's so great about this is it's containment. It's right. like right. art yes. supplies live here. Right. As opposed and it's to not like, just little ones. Yours no, would be great kids, with this. Exactly. They have all the protractors here. and the rulers yeah, and all yeah, their little cards. Right. Right. Just to have a place for and all what, to go. What our um, principal of our new kindergarten said was okay. the important thing is, it the wrong way right is yep. to. What's um, the best part? There you go. Is to have a a dedicated. So far, we're all doing very well. So anyway, you use a screwdriver. This is to put on the leg. 
Um, the important thing is for them to have a place to do their homework. That's your right. job as a parent, a dedicated yeah. place. And so, um, so this is where I went a little bit different from the ones I saw online. I wanted super strong legs because I know my son will be climbing on top of yes. these. Right. So you get these little plates. They come from the hardware store and they come with legs. Um, oh, and that's how these are, are the same. With oh, how easy! Right. Right. Do these yes. just screw in? Stop it! Can I do this? And this is like these are the stuff you would do on a coffee table or a sofa, so they're going to hold your three-year-old. Oh, this is that's great, great. and it's wide enough. It's not like yeah. exactly. How do you um, personalize this though? Because you did a great little number. Well, you can do a couple of things. So thank you very much. So yes. what I did down there for Margot's oh, was geez. all I did was a little bit of Mod Podge, uh -huh. and then I used fabric. Cute. Oh my God! Um, that. Because if you use craft paper, it doesn't quite. It's not big enough. And then a little contact tip, Madge oh. Padge. You could use contact paper, and then get your rotary cutter. Thank you very much for introducing me to this. <gasps> And just run the rotary cutter around the edge, and you get a so super easy. clean, clean oh line. You don't have to super measure. Clean. You don't, don't have measure. to measure. You know what? You could probably go to the wallpaper store and ask for scraps. Yep. And just right. use like a wallpaper right. scrap. Could you put like um like that chalkboard? Is... Well, let's see. So th there was another um, company that did that, Shades of oh. Blue Interiors, and they did a whole different look with the turn. Oh, what a great idea! White, oh, white oh. and with the chalkboard to so match your decor. So I'm more of a modern right. poppy color. Yep. And. These things cost like one to buy one, 160 bucks. This, yeah. 37. Wow. Chalkboard so paint. Chalkboard paint. Kids can make it and paint it too. See? Right?